The ability to have quality shelter continues to be a global problem. Homelessness is already an issue that affects more than 100 million people and as many as 1.6 billion people lack adequate housing around the world. It is time for those who have the power and influence to step up and enact the necessary social and economic changes to solve the homelessness problem. This includes those from the technology industry that are becoming more involved in global social issues. In 2017, tech entrepreneur Alex Stephanie launched a crowdfunding platform, Beam, that allows people to donate money that will support the homeless in London to train up and get into work. I was running a technology uh, startup before this, and I had a broad um, belief that technology might be underused um, to help with social problems. And I left that business because I wanted to do something with a lot more impact. And the, the way Beam got started is about three years ago, I got to know a homeless man at my local subway station. And I would buy this man cups of coffee and uh, pairs of socks when it was getting cold, but I could see his condition getting much worse. At one point, he actually had a heart attack. And uh, he told me that he was, you know, he shrugged, he was back on the streets and nothing had changed. And I walked home and I realized that this man was in a much worse position than he'd ever been in. Um, despite me, despite probably lots of other people trying to help him. So I thought, well, what could I have done to have made a lasting difference? And the answer is quite obvious, really. It's giving this person the skills, the opportunities, the confidence to support himself. So he's not there asking for things from other people. The problem is that that would cost a lot more than a cup of coffee. But what if we use technology and crowdfunding to allow everyone to chip in and everyone to contribute? And then we can make really a, this life-changing investment in that individual. And that is what the is really doing. It's getting together these crowds of people, these groups of people, coordinating their actions so that they can't just help in small ways, but they can really make life-changing interventions for people. The Beam website lists profiles of homeless people, including how they came to be homeless, the skills and training they need funding for, and an itemized list of what the fundraising target will be spent on. The public, who hear about Beam through social media, news stories or word of mouth, fund those homeless people's training in a way which is dignified and personalized. We have partnerships with charities who refer people to the website. Then you can go to our website, which is beam.org, and there you can meet people who are homeless, who are training to become all kinds of amazing things from bricklayers to accountants. You can fund their campaigns, so you can pay for their training. You can then um, follow their progress through the training and into skilled work. And the final stage is that once people are in skilled jobs, and this has happened now tens of times through Beam, they become supporters themselves and they fund new people to come through this model. So we launched um, under two years ago. Uh, we've had um, 15,000 donations through the platform. We funded more than 100 campaigns. We've had 75% um, uh, of people plus who've been through the program start work in their chosen career. So we think this is probably the most effective and the most empowering model for people who are very disadvantaged and long-term unemployed to get into skilled work and support themselves for good. Equipping homeless people with the skills to gain and sustain employment is the key component for Alex's philosophy to solve this problem. So if you Google the causes of homelessness, it will tell you that there are things like drugs and alcohol and mental breakdown. But we think these are more the triggers than the causes of homelessness, because many people experience these problems and don't become homeless. And the real causes, the deep causes of homelessness, we think um, is to do with a lack of what we call scaffolding in people's lives. And that scaffolding is made up of two things. First is training and education that creates economic opportunity. And second is support networks. Those support networks might be family, friends, colleagues. You can crowdfund the training, the education, and then you give them the support networks from the people who fund the training. And on average, about 200 people fund each person's campaign. And they become this new support network for the individual, really boosting their confidence and giving them that belief that this is a turning point in their life. 
Beam is backed by the Mayor of London, and it is exploring government funding solutions as an innovative approach to addressing the UK's homelessness crisis. So we do work with government already in the UK, and the long-term hope is that government will pay us to deliver this model in all sorts of different um, countries around the world. Because what we're doing is we're really helping them to help some of their most um, welfare-dependent, um, long-term unemployed people into work becoming taxpayers and that's great for society and local communities and it's also great for the economy as well. We're turning people from being receivers of tax into payers of tax and we're also filling skills gaps in the economy and helping companies to, to hire new talent. Beyond London, Beam's model can become a long-term solution to beat homelessness on a much larger scale. Crowdfunding is simply the mechanism with which we can purchase exactly what we need to empower these individuals to make this progression in their life. So a lot of the technology that we're building is very scalable. At the moment, um, we have three campaigns on the website, but you could have 100 campaigns in New York, Chicago, Paris, Montreal, Shanghai, you know, the technology would allow that completely. So, you know, definitely we, we, we're building things for scale. Technology makes it increasingly easier to help people, as well as showing people who want to make a positive difference to this problem and the impact they are having ever more clearly and transparently. There is a new and extremely effective and extremely efficient and transparent way that you can make a difference to the homelessness crisis. You can go to beam.org you can meet individuals who are looking to move forward with their lives into skilled work to support themselves and their family. And you can support them to do these amazing things. Uh, you can give a few pounds a month. Um, you can just sign up for free. Um, you can share Beam on social media. But this really needs to be a global movement if we're going to make a global impact on, on this global problem.